What up? It's your boy DJ PK, and we are back with another installment of Metroid Part Six. Uh, we might make a lot of headway in this in this uh, video, but I'm not sure. I think so, though. <laughs> but without further ado, let's finish off this Easter story. <clears throat> And this is chapter 28, verse 8. And they left the tomb quickly with fear and great joy, and ran to report it to his disciples. And behold, Jesus met them and greeted them, and they came up and took hold of his feet and worshipped him. When Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and take word to my brethren to leave for Galilee, and there they will see me. Now, while they were on their way, some of the guard came into the city and reported to the chief priests all that had happened. And when they had assembled with the elders and consulted together, they gave a large sum of money to the soldiers and said, You are to say, his disciples came by night and stole him away while we were asleep. And if this should come to the governor's ears, we will win him over and keep you out of trouble. And they took the money and did as they had been instructed. And this story was widely spread among the Jews, and is to this day. Hmm. Yep. Well, without further ado, let's go ahead and transition. <laughs> <Ta -da. laughs> Well, I just want to wish everyone a happy Easter. I know it's a little late, um, but I hope you all had a great Easter worshiping Jesus uh, and uh, spending time with your family and maybe eating candy. That's also a plus. <laughs> uh, I want to know, what is your favorite Easter candy or Easter food? Please write it in the comment section below. Let me know. I think maybe my favorite is um, the Robin's Eggs, I think. They are pretty stinking fantastic. Yeah, okay, we'll go this way. Oh, nope. <laughs> yeah, I remember this room. Oh heavens, I'm gonna die. No, get out! Get out! No! Yeah, that's bullcrap. <laughs> that is so stupid! I hate getting stuck and you just can't get out. And it just melts you. It's so lame. <laughs> Hold on, have I already gotten this power-up? I think I have, and I think I'm wasting my efforts. Oh no, not again. That's my jerk. I already got it, okay. Right. Yeah, there's no other reason to be in here, okay. Oh, I, I forgot. There's so many power-ups. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, give me health, you freaking jerks. Oh my gosh, I'm down to one health. And... <laughs> freaking glitchy game. Uh, as I'm transitioning through <laughs> through the, the panel, the enemy flew through and killed me while I could not control myself. <laughs> That's cool. Anyways... I, uh, I, uh, don't need that damage, so, I'm gonna go get a, I, I believe, I don't think I've gotten this one yet, I probably have, <laughs> I probably already got it, and I'm, uh, stupid. That's right, you little 
but not... Why didn't you freeze? Did I- guys, did I already do this? I feel like I already did this. And it was really lame. did it. Gosh dang it. Get out of here. Cheese it. Oh no, I got my missiles out. I was like, why am I killing these so well? Am I gonna die again? I feel like I'm gonna die again. Oh, heavens, the murder droid. <laughs> Oh, this game is enraging. Let's talk about something fun, though. Um, as far as the candy goes, I remember I used to eat jelly beans, but, like, I feel like the they weren't, like, that good. <laughs> like, I wasn't that interested in them. They were, like, some of them were, like, sweet and good, but, like, I feel like a number of them were kind of like that old candy taste. And it just wasn't very appealing. Though, um, I really wish I could get a, a bag of those old school, um, uh, old school jelly beans. Just because I want to, uh, you know, the n nostalgia. Okay, um, okay, yeah, there's a hole in this, okay. Get in the hole before I get angry. That's what we're talking about. Yes. I think, does this give me full... Yes, it does. Oh, uh, yeah, baby, Goyle. Oh, Aunt Jemima's ghost. Come on. Am I being stupid? I feel like I'm being stupid. Yes, the answer is yes. How I, how do I get out of here, then? Oh. No, why- Ah, oh, you freaking butthole. It makes me so angry. Maybe actually. Oh gosh, dang it! I'm pretty sure that's the way. I think you can just step down from there. I'm taking all my anger and frustration on you. Give me that health. But uh, it's interesting. Um, gosh darn it. Um, it's interesting how uh in. I'm about to lose my mind. Um, in in the why do I keep on doing that? All right, I'm just gonna gun it. There we go. Yep. Um, it's interesting in the biblical account how it addresses like detractors. It's like, um, yeah, people tried lying about it. Uh. What is happening here? Why is it that there? Am I down too low? I yeah, yeah, I was. Okay, you freaking jerks. Um, but yeah, I mean, like, I feel like a lot of um. You know, false religions tend to, um, try to remove any form of criticism 
uh, from from their books or any hint of like falseness. Um, but it's interesting to see that the Bible does not do that. They address the uh, the lies of the time, the deception, um, the critiques. So I think it's very unique in that sense. Like, look, they're going to lie about it, but it's true it happened. They're going to try to hide it, but it's true it happened. So I think that's pretty cool. Looks like I need to go down, all the way down first, just to get that missile. Actually, though... No, get out of here. It looks like the easiest path might be just to go all the way to the left, all the way down, and straight to the right. Okay, that looks like the easiest one. Let's go. We're gonna try it. <laughs> Dude, dude, dude. Uh, my buddy Kyle over at um, oh, crap, what is it? Roving incident. There we go. Yeah. Um, he uh recommended on one of my videos that I uh do a different Bible story for each one of the the videos I created, and I think that's a fun idea, actually. So. I, uh, I think I'm going to start doing that. Though I think that I should do one step further and actually do, uh, like, discuss it in, in, like, detail. Like, a, a, I guess, a sermon, if you will. People don't need more video game let's plays, they need more Jesus. That's uh that's one hundred percent. Ah you jerk. Yep, and it damaged me. Freaking butt. Fake! Dude, that's a miracle. I didn't get hit. <laughs> so now I can just go straight through and pick up a, a missile. You jerk. Get off of me! <laughs> Sorry for the sniffing. I've got a runny nose right now for some reason. Interesting Japanese fact. Um... Typically, um, blowing your nose in public is kind of, uh, they think it's disgusting, so they would prefer that you didn't do that. Um, I, th but, you know, generalizing an entire culture, uh, you know, is never 100% true, you know, like, some people don't care, of course. You know, some old people do it, they don't care. They just blow their nose. Um, some people, though, however, you know, they do think it's disgusting. I know that's the case in America as well, but generally speaking, um, blowing your nose isn't really that big of a deal in America. Like, if you're at the dinner table, we might be like, dude, go blow your nose somewhere else or something, you know. But if you're, uh, if you're like in the classroom or in the office or something, like, we don't care. Um, but, did I just take, I swear if I took two bits of damage from that, I'm gonna flip out! <laughs> yeah, this is the part that's a nightmare. I've actually made it through those <laughs> in a previous playthrough, but they're obnoxious. Oh, I need to go through that one. 
but uh, like I said, <laughs> that is not um, that that doesn't bother Japanese people. They would actually prefer that over you um, blowing your nose right on top of them. I hate this part. This is so annoying. I just get in the habit of, like, I wish there was, I could figure out, like, the exact technique and just roll with it. Come on, yeah, that's what we're talking about. But I just lose control and just button mash at <laughs> those moments. Open the door. Alright, now we need to go down and to the left, and then we'll get to that missile. Missile. Missile Tau. <laughs> tau Missile. See, as you can see, this, uh, screw attack is a game changer. like Kraid. I did not know that he was down here. I'm really confused. Okay, his fingers are super strong in this one as well. Okay, now he's gonna take me off. Now his uh, fingernails block me. Oh, dude, I blew his booty up. Is that baby Kraid? If I recall correctly, I'm pretty sure Kraid is actually pretty small in this game. Like, in Super Metroid, he's much bigger. Oh yeah, by the way, um, Alvin over at Gaudi's Retro Room, thank you for reminding me. I, I knew you had my back on that one. Mother Brain is, in fact, in this game. After you play, like, several Metroid games, it really starts to blend together, and you're like, I don't remember when and where Mother Brain is. She's in, like, all of them. <laughs> okay, not all of them, but, you know. I will say that I was really, really happy with the remakes. I'm not gonna lie. Um, they, uh, did a better job of implementing the actual lore and, and story behind it into the game. <laughs> Something these early games did not do. Like, this game, there's no lore. <laughs> like, you have no idea what's going on. Also, it's kind of funny, um, I recently saw an article on, uh, on Google that was recommended for me, and it was basically saying that, um, I didn't read it, I just, from the title, it says, uh, Nintendo didn't understand bounty hunters. <laughs> There's a picture of Samus, and then I thought, Reflecting on the game, I thought, yeah, you know what? You're, you're kind of right, because, um... Like, they keep on saying she's a bounty hunter, she's a bounty hunter. Um, but then, like, in none of the games is there any level of bounty hunting. <laughs> like, she never... I, I guess they argue that, like, okay, well... She's a, she's more of a mercenary, actually, than a, than a bounty hunter. So, like, they pay her, like, the, the military pays her as a mercenary to go and, like, um, like, kill targets or whatever, or rescue the planet or something. So she's really much more of a mercenary than a, a bounty hunter. 
take that, Metroid. No! You butthole. What? Huh? Did I... Did I already get this one? I don't remember getting this one. No way. I don't believe it. Did I really? No, 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 no. Did I go the wrong way? Where am I? I did go the wrong way. No. I absolutely went the wrong way. How? I'm really confused. How did I get there? Actually, I'm pretty sure I didn't. Okay, I must have already gotten the missile and forgot about it. Well, I guess we're gonna go punch Kraid in the face, and we can go up and get that missile on the way back out. Now let's go punch him in the face. Hey, baby Kraid! That's right, dude. I just screwed and attacked Kraid in the face. Woo! Yeah. Let's go kill the real Kraid. We're gonna punch him in his face. Uh, was that a glitch? Because I went right through that pillar. That was interesting. Get away from me! Oh, you butt. Okay, here I am. No? Okay, where am I? I just went through that area. Is this map not right? I'm really confused. Is there not a way through this? There we go, I was gonna say. Freaking butthead, right? Alright, we're gonna go fight Kraid, y'all. Uh, maybe I should grind up and get a little more- Oh my gosh. I forgot. I can grind it in here. They're really, uh, generous right here. <laughs> That's right. Take it down a notch. And Crate is dead, baby boys. Uh, there's an energy tank in here. Where? 
Or did I already get it? Straight and up. I'll get that other. This is really exciting for everyone. Sorry, I was checking the time. Go, go, go. Go, Speed Racer, go. Dude, how many of you guys remember falling asleep with the TV on, Toonami, and then waking up at like 2 in the morning when they started playing that stupid Speed Racer theme song? It always jerked me out of sleep, and like, I swear, that song, like, would play for five minutes straight. Like, I think because I was in, like, a, a sleep state, and I could hear it, that it felt like it just continued, oh my gosh, I'm just losing it all. Gosh dang it. Okay, that's it. But uh, it would always, like, jerk me out of sleep. I saw another uh, funny video on YouTube about uh, <laughs> Inuyasha's, like, uh, when that's, when the song would come on, it was always so loud. Like, Like, just super loud. And this girl was, like, pretending to be asleep and jerked out of sleep. It was... It was hilarious. I was like, yes, it's so true. They really had no, like, good audio balancing on Toonami. They didn't care. <laughs> they were just like, yeah, it's gonna be really quiet. And then, like, when the music hits, BOOM! Oh, yeah, thanks for taking ten points of health for no reason. You butternut squash. so annoying. Where I need to go? Yes, it is. Okay. This should be the, uh, you jerk. There we go. This is the last missile tank in this area. Oh, 
why this is why I was saying we're gonna make a lot of headway because I knew it was gonna smoke Kraid and uh... now we just leave I think we have to go to Ridley now right because Turingen is the last and I've already done that I've already done that I've already done all that yeah I just need to go to Ridley and kill him there's a uh, one, two, three more missile tanks, or missile tanks, missile upgrades, and two energy tanks, but one of them you get from Ridley, so. Yeah. Though Ridley in all the games is really annoying. So, I need to go up one, to the left, and up. I swear if I fall all the way to the bottom, I'm going to lose my mind. Oh, 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 no, no, no! Oh my gosh! That's awful! No, no, oh! <laughs> I have half a mind to just kill myself. Not, not literally in the game, folks. Because <laughs> uh. then I just pop back up at the elevator, I think. Uh, it's so precarious. I hate that. I hate how you have to jump just right. Not again. One second. Sorry about that, y'all. Uh, had the post at the door. Yes, coffee. <laughs> I almost went the wrong way. <laughs> I was half tempted to go through that door. And guys, if I would have fallen through that hole, I would have lost my mind. Let's go. Come on, baby boy. Why would they put... <sighs> Just to waste my missiles, you jerks. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at those missiles, man. I got over a honey. Yeah, over a hundred, girl. Okay, now I just need to go up and leave this wretched place. Uh, how do I go about doing that? Oh no. Well. Uh, I didn't know he was. Uh, I didn't know you could kill him. Um. Can you kill these yellow guys? I, he didn't look red to me. You know, let me waste my time some more. Oh gosh, dang it! How okay? You guys got to be honest. How cheap is that? That you can take damage? Is it really gone? Okay, screw this. No, I, I've already got very low health. I'm I'm dying. I'm I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. Trying to grind through this stage some more so I can get back up there. That's stupid. I'm taking the death elevator. It's faster. Yes.
but look at those missiles, man. That's so beautiful. It's beautiful. Well, that's a crazy looking password. Get out of here. Mm, mm. Come on now. Unfortunately, we have to backtrack now. Which is a little annoying that they did that. Like, it would have been nice if they just created a separate area for Ridley instead of making you just go back to where you were. Because then it just seems more tedious that you have to just backtrack. You're like, you mean I was already there looking and breathing at Ridley? I'm breathing at, uh, breathing on. <laughs> breathing, breathing at, where am I from? Do I speak English? Okay. Do they speak English and what? Say what one more time. I dare you. I double dog, triple dog did. Okay, that's not in the movie. But it should have been. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna kill you. Okay, nope, you're gonna kill me. I swear. I swear. When the moon and the stars in the sky. This is for you, Alvin. I'll be there. <laughs> I just lost all my subscribers. I need to go up and to the right. <laughs> Come get some. Is that my max right now? 103? It's really good. Like I said in the previous videos, you need missiles. Especially on Mother Brain, she's annoying. You need missiles. And of course, like I said, Ridley is always annoying. And you need missiles. But, I mean, I'm sure you guys all witnessed me play very, very... Oh, I have more than... Oh, that's beautiful. You guys witnessed me play very, very recklessly against, uh, Kraid. Uh, when you have missiles, you can do that. Let's go up there and pump them. I'm gonna go straight down. In the tunnel of love. I don't, I don't know, guys. I'm sorry. Okay, you want to you want to destroy that enemy instead of making me angry? <laughs> Freaking butthead. Dude, I'm I'm worried I'm gonna get flagged for saying the the B word. Dude, I have 109. Whoa. That's beautiful. Beautiful. We need to take the the escalator down. Oh, this is gonna be a super easy run there. It looks like it. Take the elevator, then right, and then straight down. Straight down to the left. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. This is good. I'll be there in like two seconds. Yeah. Look, if you're wondering if you made the right decision by subscribing or watching this video, right? That's on you, right? I have made zero claims of sanity. Or of uh, a balanced mental health. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, you should listen to me. 
Yeah, you do what you want to do, I don't care. I'm gonna make these videos for fun. For me and my friends. For my friends and my family. My friends and my family. Uh, uh, friends of the family. You don't know them, you don't know me. Uh. Ugh. Can you stop? Those micro jumps. Look how useless they are. Oh my gosh. I thought I I'm I'm shocking myself with how high my missile count is going. Because I didn't realize it was so high. Golly. Almost 120. I'm a beast. 121, dear heavens, it just keeps on going up. 125. Am I gonna hit the 130 mark? Do I even need any more? Dear heavens. Oh, did it just stop? I think it just stopped. Can you hit the enemy? Dear heavens! I just want life. I just don't want to die. That's all. Here we go, go down. We are entering North Air. We're just gonna run right. <laughs> I, I literally just tapped right twice to run. <laughs> I've been playing uh, Kirby a lot. So. And that's how you run in Kirby. Oh my gosh, I do. I have I have over 130. Oh my goodness. I'm a wrecking machine. Oh, of course. Yeah, I can get help and then I fall right in the lava pit. <laughs> What the crap? Can I not destroy these? Oh, I can't. Okay. I thought they were the other ones. It's this one. No, I need to go all the way to the bottom. If only I could get some, uh, life. Should take me to an elevator to Ridley. Now we're in Ridley's lair. <laughs> okay. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there are obnoxious traps.
for example, there's like a spot where there's like a hole that you can fall down when you're just trying to get an item. Yeah, don't know why he wasn't spiraling, or she wasn't spiraling. Okay, you're making me angry. Okay. No, this is unfair. Come on. Freaking robot sea turtles or whatever the crap you are. I'm gonna freaking die. Nope. Getting it, yes. Now I'm at a dead end. Oh, see? There's a nice little trap right there. It's okay, I don't care if I die. My health is so low. I'm gonna pop up right back up. Right ba 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 boo ba ba boo boo. And let's see. I think that's the route I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna go head left to death. I don't freaking know. Oh, yes. Oh, this is easy. Well, this is where you fill up before you fight the boss. Got that screw tech if you don't you're in trouble. Interesting. They haven't uh oh, gosh dang it. come on. Uh oh you jerk. Oh no. Okay. No, gosh dang it. Am I really gonna have to try to climb this? This is gonna be so annoying. Come on. Come on. Oh, that's right, I forgot. I remember I ran into the same problem before I'm an idiot. Pretty sure there's a hole here. Okay. 
Okay, I'm not gonna worry about it. We're just gonna go back up and get it the other way, even though it's obnoxious. It's annoying because the guide that I'm following doesn't show, or not guide, but the uh, the map that I'm looking at does not show where the hole was. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? <sighs> I'm gonna kill myself. I, it's... It's too, uh, obnoxious to try to go all the way back around. I'm probably gonna... probably gonna fall down the hole. I don't know... why would you cover the hole with an icon, you freaking idiot? Uh... why? WHY?! This is the part that I hate the most, by the way. This hole. <laughs> uh, when I played this, I played this on an emulator. Like, when I beat it, so I could save state just before that stupid hole. And, uh... Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. still open. <sighs> Gosh dang it. That's one of the most annoying things about this game, is the fact that they don't give you things that you need when you need it. They, it's just completely random, so you could be drowning in missiles and then you have no health, and then they, they're like, oh hey, we're gonna drop you like five missiles. I go, like, oh, thanks, that's wonderful. Why didn't I count how many blocks that was? Oh, I should have counted. This is part of my problem. It's me. <laughs> it's me. Yes! I did it! In your face, you freaking butt. Okay. Now, I can just go to the left and straight down with no problem. If I can survive. Oh, that's right, I have full tanks. Yes! You, okay, Ridley, you're so much trouble. Shoot you in the face with a rocket! Did 
die and give me your life energy. Oh, heavens. Get away from me. Get away. No. Oh, 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 oh. Of course. <laughs> it's, uh, I'm in both of them in both times. <laughs> Get out of my face. Gonna keep on going right. It's so annoying with these short tunnels. They knew exactly what they were doing. They're like, oh yeah, you can't use the screw attack here. <laughs> they laughed just like that too. <laughs> like, like a jerk. Actually, I can't reach that missile from here. I thought I could, but I can't. I gotta go all the way around. Screw that. I'm just gonna go and fight Ridley. Those extra missiles might be nice, but I don't think it's gonna keep me from beating him. I can get it on the way back. Okay, we're just gonna go up one. Cheese it. Apparently, it's still effective a little bit. That's nice. Sweet of them. This is the room that's connected to that missile that I wanted, but I can't get it. I can't reach that high. It's a... Gosh, I, mean, I thought I could climb up or something, but I guess I can't. Guys, we're about to fight Ridley. It's about to get real. Do you see the slowdown on this? <laughs> oh my gosh. Original hardware, folks. Come on. I'm alright. Welcome to Ridley, guys. Let's smoke him. It the slowdown is so bad right now. Oh, he 
gotta be kidding me. And this is the worst part you could find yourself in. Stuck down in this lava down here. Needlessly running out of health. <laughs> Take that Ridley, you butt. Gosh, this game is lagging out. Hardcore. No, come on. Okay, this is gonna make me angry. It's the lag is really bad. <sighs> That's right. <clears throat> uh check that missile count. What is that? 177? Is that normal? Oh, it's not lava, okay. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we did. Guys, give me one second. Alright, I'm back. I'm back, baby. So there was a hole that you could fall in, you freaking jerks. <laughs> There's an enemy in here? <laughs> Did it fly in here from that other screen or something? Or do they occupy this room now that he's gone? They want to be the next Ridley. Okay, you can die too. slowing down so much. It's too bad they don't have the flying attack in this one. What is it, a space jump? Where you can, you do the screw attack, but you can do it repeatedly and just fly through the air. Okay, come on here. Gonna make me angry. Take back what I said, because apparently you can still do it without the animation. Okay. Do I need to go up to... Starting to make me angry. You don't like me when I'm angry. Get out of here. Alright, I'm back at the main elevator. Oh, I need to go left and then straight down. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. I gotta jump down the pit. I swear, if I don't get this missile, I'm gonna flip out, though. <laughs> it looks like it's pre 
it's pretty precarious to get over there. Like, there's like holes that you can easily fall down and not get what you're seeking. See ya. Now, it's hard to have this many filled tanks. I got six and I got 99. So it's almost like having seven full tanks. Uh, again, as I said, it's really nice to have that because it's really annoying to build up seven full tanks. Okay, this is what I don't want to do. Oh my gosh. That looks like it's really easy to fall in. Yep! Gosh. Okay, screw it. I'm not. I'm not getting it. I'm not gonna waste any more time on that. That's stupid. That is so stupid. Because now I'm gonna have to go all through this stage all over again. That's why I like save states. <laughs> because they do this stupid stuff like this, where it's like, okay, well, we're gonna punish you and make you go through a bunch of tedious bull jive. It's stupid. It's stupid. You shouldn't have to sit there and like go through the entire world just to get back around to that. It's not fun. So I'm gonna say screw it. And I'm gonna go, I'm gonna see if I can go kill Mother Brain. Now, another annoying part is the fact that I have to go all the way back through Norfair. So basically just to get back, er, to get to the boss. You've literally got to go through the entire game. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> well, actually, though, granted, it is a pretty quick shot through Norfair, so... Take him down a notch.
Oh yeah. So, uh, as for my other idea, thanks to Roving Incident, uh, it, by the way, if you, uh, you like, uh, relaxing videos, um, through, uh, in getting to see the world, I recommend, um, Roving Incident's channel. Um, it's very relaxing, very interesting. You get to see, uh, parts of the U.S., which is really fun. Come on! Uh, but, uh, as for his, uh, recommendation about, um, reading, uh, Bible verses and whatnot, uh, what would you like to hear, or I guess not Bible verses, Bible stories, um, what would you like to hear? Oh, no. oh, oh. Please leave your comment in the comment section below and let me know what you want to hear. Or if you have any questions, for example, I'll try to answer those questions um, to the best of my abilities. So if you've got like theological questions or questions about um, the Bible or things that they're in, leave them in the comment section. I'll do my best to, to respond. Time, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it. Uh, we're at Brinstar. Go left, up, left. Yeah, here we come. Though, granted, I think they do kind of uh, give you this area. There's a benefit. There's a, there is a benefit um, because these enemies are super easy, which means that they are super easy to grind and get your get your energy and your missiles and stuff. So that is the benefit of going back through all the way through at the beginning. That's beautiful. I'm max, I think, right now. Hmm? Oh, that's right. Now I need to go up and to the left. Look at her go, Samus, and all her beast modeness. You freaking jerk. Okay, this should connect me to Brinstar again. <laughs> I guess West Brinstar. Need to go north all the way. I'm gonna be so excited if I can actually beat this in time. It'd be perfect too. Perfect uh, timing. Sorry, I needed to. You need your missiles, man. The more you have, the more reckless you can be, the easier the battle. I think. Alright. Okay, here we are. Hey, ghosts. That's right. Jerks. Now this connects us to Turian. Okay, can we 
we do it? Can we do it? Oh, it's gonna be a tight, tight run. Okay, this is the worst part. The Metroids. I try to conserve my missiles if I can. That's right, I forgot you gotta use them on the Metroids too. Should be just freezing them and not wasting my my missile tanks or my missiles. Missile tanks. What am I talking about? Freaking donuts. <laughs> Dang it! Screw you, buttholes. Go! Oh. <sighs> I'm running out of time. I think I'm on the last stretch to Mother Brain, though. I swear if there's more Metroids, I'm gonna be so irritated. Leave me alone. Oh. Come on. Get away from me. No! Stop! Here. Okay, yes. This is the worst part, is these things regenerate, and it just spends more of your missiles. Oh my gosh, my health's already freaking tragically low.
Mother brain is really difficult. <sighs> and of course, I'm gonna have none of my health. Which makes this impossibly difficult. Ugh. I hate that so much. It's so unfair that they rob you of your health. And now... Of course, I'm gonna have to go back and grind just to get my health back up. I hate that. And get my missiles back. Don't forget that. I probably will not be able to face her again. I'm gonna try, but... The lag was, like, awful. Is that... Is there something wrong with, uh, my setup, or is... Is that... Is that... Does anyone remember that being the... The... The usual for this game? I guess I'm directing that towards you, um... Gaudi's Retro Room. You're the, the Metroid Pro. Yeah, thanks for not activating that. That makes me really happy. It's amazing to have that much health and then to have it all gone. I really need to uh, be more careful when it comes to the uh... just getting to Mother Brain is is uh, the difficult part. Because I need it, you need to like conserve your health so that you don't, um, you don't just get killed right off the bat. Because uh, the, the, the hard part is that, I mean, you saw it, you can easily, easily fall into the, uh, uh, easily fall into the, that lava, and it just. And you're repeatedly getting shot by those stupid blasts. As you can see, my patience is the, uh... That makes this the hardest, because... You're supposed to, like, you know, play it really safe and... Try to dodge those things and shoot those things and... It, see, the thing is about that, though, is, like, it just makes the boss battle take forever. So then you're just... I, I like to try to get up there, boom, 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 and, and blast them off, you know? Sometimes you can get lucky and you can get up on that ledge where you can just sit there and pump, you know, pump the boss full of missiles. This is annoying. This is not a good place to grind. Because of these obnoxious buckles. These guys are much better. Of course, yep. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. It's already 11.36, I gotta start getting ready soon. I remember running into this when I was playing on my Game Boy, trying to prepare for the boss and just these enemies taking forever to grind. I want, I really, I really want to know what they were thinking um, when they thought this was a good idea to like make, uh, like, the health system this bad. <laughs> I mean, like, they're like, yeah, yeah, um, 
you should have to kill enemies, a thousand enemies, just to fill your tanks. It's like, oh, that's, that's fun. Why not just build a system where if you die, you come back with full health? And max missiles. Or, you know, at least full health. And then make me grind for the missiles or something. I like what they did later in the games where they implemented um, refill stations because they knew that, that it was a stupid game mechanic that they really messed up on. Like, yeah, no, no one likes to sit here and grind enemies for like an hour just so that they can fight the boss to die again. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, they literally make it excruciating to fight the final boss. Might as well, I might as well just go back to those areas where... And on top of that, I'm going to completely ignore the Metroids. I'm just going to freeze them and run. Well, this is a good place. I think. If I'm not mistaken, there's a lot of these flying and noxious enemies. Coming for you. Would be in a butt. Okay, now you're making me angry. Come on. Well, when they're behaving, it's easy. <laughs>
I'm not gonna have enough time for this, so <laughs> it's less than optimal, but um We're going to try to fight him. <laughs> I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose horribly, but it's better than nothing, huh? Better than just watching me grind for no reason. But let's see if we can pull off a miracle. Got like eight minutes. Take what I can get. As I said before, you can't rush Metroid, so this is most likely going to end in sadness. Pretty sure they don't drop any health, right? They're just obnoxious butts. Get out of my face. See, it's so cheap. Did you see how much health I've lost just from those stupid energy beams? Oh, run. Oh, he's... And he's sucking me my health away while I'm transitioning to another room. Oh, great. Is it broken already? Oh my goodness. Is that an actual pit? Or is that a glitch? I wonder if he still maintains damage.
God. Dang it. Oh, I was so close. Uh, well, that I was playing it much safer if I would have had full missiles and full uh full health, I probably would have beaten it. I was at a severe disadvantage, but I was so close. Oh mm, man. Well, unfortunately, I we have no more time, so we'll have to try to finish it at a later day. Transition. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. You saw that juicy password. So if you want to play where I left off with almost full everything, like, I think I literally skipped on one missile pack and that's it. And I'm not going back for it. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> All right. Well, if you like what I do, give me a like, share, subscribe. Um, and as always, love, peace, Afro-Grease, and happy Easter. He is risen.